Hello, this is, um, my, uh, my first win in the new season, and also where I figured out to be the best landing spot in Chapter 4, Season 3. This is, um, a somewhat intense game. I get 10 kills, but as you can see, I'm bashing my guitar on the tree, but... I want to show y'all how I won, or I'm going to talk over how I won. I, you already know, I'm on the battle bus. And you see why I got marked? Um, I'm about to pull up my mini-map. I'll show y'all. It's in the middle of Mega City, and the new, like, Temple P.O.I. So, I obviously drop, you know. I'm just dropping. Does anyone else uh, figure, uh, realize that the gliders, like when you're gliding, it feels slower. I don't know if it's the glider I have on or what, but it feels slower. But anyways, you see this tiny area. Not much people know about it yet, so they don't land there. But I was, I landed there. There's a lot of these temples over the map, but this one is my favorite and I'll tell you why so I land there I'm looking at these uh, torch well first I'm getting a weapon I get two purples that is amazing for what I'm about to do but I look at the torches or maybe not I thought I did never mind oh uh, I heard a guy alright so I killed him and I started looking at all the torches I'm checking to see which ones are lit and which ones are not. And then I hear a chest, but but I'm checking which torches are lit and which ones are uh, extinguished. So I realize that one's the only one that's on and then the middle one's off. So you'll understand what I mean. So you have to give an item. It has to be purple or above. It doesn't care if it's a consumable or anything. But now you can see we get five uh, flames in the room. And I have to match what was in the other building. So as you see, I didn't have a good weapon, so I'm obviously looting. Uh, so, as you see, I'm about to... I'm just popping my shields. Uh, I'm not... And then after I pop my shields, I hear someone, so I'm just... Uh, scared and I start extinguishing the flames because there is one that's supposed to be lit okay then I figure out it's not that one so I disestinguish this extinguish it and then I realize it's not that one either I don't know what's the positions are and then it's not that one either and the final one it opens the door so you know I'm uh, boxing up so I don't get shot in the back or anything. Uh, in that little room I was just in, there's a free boomerang, kinetic boomerang too. So it says seek statue. There's two statues. One is the correct statue. The other one will rift you on top of the POI and you most likely get shot down. So I luckily picked the right statue. And I'm blocking myself. And then you got this room. This room is the most OP room I've ever seen. It has multiple rare chests. And you can get almost every new chapter 4 season 3 weapon in this little vault area. But it's really easy to do and you don't have to wait like the other vaults where the boss is and stuff. So, as you see, I'm just looting up. Um, and I'm just checking the loot. Actually, I kind of got unlock lucky because I got snipers in the Maven Autos, which the Maven Autos are not my favorite. And as you see, since I picked the right statue, I used the wrong statue to my advantage. Because I, someone was camping me there. So, uh, I realized if I got out of there, uh, by the way I entered, I was just gonna get shot. 
And I just went here to show y'all why this is one of my favorites. If you don't find a purple weapon in that building, you can go to Sloan and buy a purple weapon to open it. So that's why this one's my favorite. Because even if there's no purple weapon in that building, you can just go to Dr. Sloan, which I hate. I hate Dr. Sloan. And buy the flapjack rifle for not even that expensive. I'm not for sure, but I'm pretty sure it's purple every time. So, as you see, I'm struggling uh, on this zip line. And I found this mushroom. And now I'm going over here. I see this little icon. I don't know what it is, but it's actually for a challenge, which actually I'm going to post a, a challenge grind video where I grind all the challenges for this week. And it'll be like a weekly thing I do, by the way. And then I hear gunshots, or actually I'm seeing if this place actually has a secret vault. I'm pretty sure it does not. So, I'm pretty sure after looking around, I end up leaving. But I do hear gunshots. As you can see, I have visual sound effects. Uh, I'm just messing around, hidden flowers and all that. Um, it's pretty cool. And then I realized the shooting's coming up from that hill. So, you know what I do? I uh, go up the zipline. And then this is, this is funny. I jump, uh, throw the boomerang, and it hits him. But I fell down. And I thought he went up the log cabin. But I'm, I'm, I'm really wrong. Like, he didn't even, he did not. So I just chopped this down. But, actually, chopping this down actually helped me get a kill. I thought he was up there, but I realized he wasn't. And I thought the sh uh, dr green drum shotgun in my inventory was an AR. But as you see, I'm sniping his wall. And then I just throw boomerangs at him. Bam. Bam. See, if you, uh, in if you uh, press right click in flight, it detonates. And it's easy to uh, blow up their builds. But, well, at least in wood. As you can see, it does not work well. And I realize I have a drum shotgun. So I pick up that weapon, and I accidentally almost fell to my doom. Be careful on these cliffs. And I jump to this tree, and I start shooting his things. And he's practically dead now. And I realize you can't build in the trees. So make sure y'all don't build in the trees. And I hop on the zip line. I'm chasing him. And then he has the Cybertron. I don't even know what he's doing. He's like one health. And the Flapjack rifle, it has a lot of recoil. So I'm trying to kill him. But And then he actually almost gets me here. Okay, so I'm coming in. I don't know why I'm reloading my sniper. I hit him 26 headshot. He thought I fell. So he's just building. But I didn't. And he fell to his doom. I, I don't know how. But he fell to his doom. So, as you can see, I completed that challenge. It's not very hard. All you have to do is collect different cannons. Um, ignore my dog. I'm sorry. And, I don't know. This guy's shooting me. I don't know where at. Until I find him. Um, and I just rush him. With the cannon. I realize they're in a fight. And I shoot. And I thought I hit him. Or thought I was going to hit him. And then this guy's just spamming. I'm pretty sure he's a bot. And this guy shows up. Uh, I'm trying to throw my boomerang at him. Because I just guessed he wasn't that good. So uh, he's coming. I load up my Cybertron rifle. Whatever. And then. Blast them. I missed. Wait did I miss? I don't know. But I won't pump him. No worry about it. And then this guy shows up. I hit him with a boomerang, and then I hit him with another boomerang, then I shoot him in the head a couple times. So, you know, I'm just looting up. And, the funny part is, I didn't move a single, I, d I just did a full circle. So I'm back where I landed. I'm still, I still, 
Um, I'm back where I landed. I did a full circle. I got five kills on the board. I'm feeling pretty good about this one. As you can see, I got mud. The mud makes it so uh, thermal snipers cannot see you. And makes it so you slide faster. So mud is really good. So I think this is an enemy's build. It is. But I thought it was like a different temple. Then I realized I, I was legit just here. Then I realized I can use the rift again. Because you can use the rift how many times you want. It doesn't go away. So I'm just editing my way. I'm a slow editor. I'm just editing my way through. And then I use the rift to go. And I'm just gliding. And I realize the boss has spawned at this area. So I'm just gliding to where I see the boss. But be careful with the Cy Cybertron uh, Blaster thingy mythic. Because you can do damage to yourself. And as you see here, it also boosts you back. I'll just wait for y'all to see. And I thought I, my game was over right here. So, I land here. I load up the Cyber uh, Tron Cannon. And I jump. But you actually take fall damage. And then once I realized that, I retreated. Tried to throw a boomerang. It got blocked by a barrel. Because I'm pretty sure um, the boomerangs don't do damage to builds or anything. Or, not that I know of. So, uh, I actually hear, I think I hear a player, but it's actually just the NPCs. And I see the boss's foot. I miss every shot, but I actually kill the guy that I knocked. And then I headshot that guy, and then I uh, kill the boss. Easy. And then, you gotta be careful here. Uh, so I grabbed the Mythic. I grabbed the Vault Keycard. But, I was not safe. And under those stairs right there, people can hide very easily. So when you're checking the vault, make sure to check under the stairs. Because there might be um, a visitor, I guess you could say, waiting for you. But luckily, there was no visitor. And uh, the vault actually gives you the Mythic flak Flapjack Rifle. So I put that in my inventory. And I'm just looting up, uh, hold on, I'm gonna cut my looting up out of the video real quick. Okay, I just looted the vault, uh, I saved y'all, like, a lot of time because it was very boring. And I realize I hear someone, and as you see, I'm using the stairs to my advantage. And this guy breaks the roof, and I... I didn't even know he broke the roof, honestly. I was just sitting there. And I was waiting for him. And I see him. I'm pretty sure he saw me and ran away. I'm not for sure. But then he runs around the corner. And then pumps once, pumps twice, dead. And I'm mostly max mats because of that uh, landing spot I showed you. So I hear a boomerang and a fight. And... This guy just killed another guy. So I'm trying to throw my boomerang at him. It's not working. So I shoot my Cybertron rifle uh, towards him. And try and break his build to make him annoy him. And then he acts, he faces to his build. I hit him one hit. So he's running away now. But sadly, my kill gets taken by this little dude. And then I slide too far, and I could have killed him real easily. But he tries to box up. I'm trying to find him. And turns out he actually moved there. I fell, forgot to build. And I was like, Cybertron rifle. I hit the wall right above him and did a bunch of damage. And that's mostly the only reason why I won this fight. So make sure to use walls to your advantage because the mythic actually does splash damage so actually right now i didn't know there was um 
a floating the floating island was above me but that actually gives you the mythic drum shotgun just so y'all know so i'm just chilling you know reloading my weapons and you know that reload shotgun augment i got look how well it works like i load my shotgun so fast it's insane but i'm done reloading and i'm ready to fight i see the floating island but i didn't want to risk it because this was a good game seven kills 10 people left i didn't want to risk it so I, so i just moved um to, to uh slappy springs or slappy slappy um what is it called slappy shores i forgot what it's called uh but i actually i thought no one was there and then this guy started shooting me and i just retreated he looks like a decent player, so I didn't want to risk it, and I'm just going to let him have it. So I land here, and I realize I'm getting shot at. A guy off in the distance is shooting me. So I run over, uh, I hit him, 28, I realize this is a bot because he has no shield. And I hit the Cybertron rifle at him, and bam, I hit it off his stairs. You see how large that blast radius is? And I complete another challenge. So, yeah. Now, I'm just shooting this guy. Uh, I'm gonna blame it on the recoil. And I try to break this forklift, but it does no damage. Oh, actually it did. I didn't realize that. And I slowly slide over. And then, bam, headshot. I don't know who she's shooting at, but so I'm scared because I can't find him. So I just build up and I'm sorry to tell y'all this, but I can't in the tower. I just can't. So I'll skip the video for y'all. So, um, I'm just swimming and I regret to inform y'all that, sadly, I end up camping with this. Not in that bush though, in a different bush. So, I just end up camping in that bush, there's five people left. I'm checking the bush with the boomerang, and I camp, so I will skip this part. Okay, I move out my bush, and I'm coming towards this other bush. But wait, I don't camp for that long. I go up and I realize this could be a free elim and it was. I just go pop 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 and then this recoil on this gun is really bad but still and I see that guy in the distance he knows where I am I hit him 83 white and then whoop, boom and he's dead and that's how I won my first chapter 4 season 3 game. And that is also where the best landing spot Woo! is. I did it. So. I did it. I did it. I did that's it. That's it. That's all I have for y'all. Goodbye. German Gag is out.